What's up guys, it's Kebab Alaba here and today we have a brand new Nuketown 2026 Easter Egg and I'm not just talking about the Zombies Easter Egg we found out a long time ago Yes ladies and gentlemen, this is a brand new Easter Egg and involves shooting the arms of the mannequins instead of a head What more can I say guys, it's absolutely insane how many sneaky little Easter Eggs Treyarch have implemented into their game Black Ops 3 came out quite recently too so who knows how many more Easter Eggs we'll find Treyarch have always been excellent with their Easter Eggs in previous Black Black Ops games, but honestly guys, this year they've taken it to another level. I think they're really harnessing the power of the next generation consoles this year. Anyway, let's talk about builds happening on the screen. As you can see, the final mannequin just lost his arms, which will activate the Easter egg. Now, shooting the arms of the mannequins in two minutes really isn't easy to pull off guys. You literally have to be a professional gamer if you want to pull it off. So I highly recommend you team up with a friend so they can shoot the arms of the mannequins in one side of the map and whilst you're shooting off the arms of the mannequins in the other side of the map. Even if you have two people trying to complete the easter egg, it can still be a bit of a nuisance as the mannequins spawn in different locations every time you launch Nuketown. So you really need to be on top of your phone before you even attempt to complete it or you'll find that this is one of the most stressful things you've ever attempted. But guys, would you just look at the screen? It's definitely worth it as you'll have a fantastic time messing around with your friends. No, seriously, this Easter egg definitely leans towards the creepy side of things. There'd be certain times where they'd attack me from nowhere and it like scares the absolute crap out of you. Not to mention that my entire body was literally covered in goosebumps. So guys, if you don't like scary things, uh, stay away from this Easter egg. If I'm entirely honest, I think I enjoyed the first Easter egg more, but I mean, don't listen to me because the second Easter egg game, the creeps, so that's why I probably say that. Now the mannequins from the first easter egg are essentially the zombies from zombies mode but just retextured to have the textures of the mannequins and the mannequins from the second easter egg are a bit like the weeping angels from doctor who so they essentially follow you and get closer every time you look away and we've reached the end of yet another video guys i've been uploading every single day as promised so hopefully you're enjoying my content please like subscribe and comment guys and i'll see you in my next video